We are in these sort of straightened times um, because of a, a global economic meltdown. And if we thought that that was over, perhaps we should be a little more, well tentative about celebrating because there was a deal to resolve the US debt crisis and it is expected to be ratified by the Senate this afternoon. Had it not been, uh, it would have been catastrophic, not just for the United States, but for everybody. Um, So a failure between the Democrats and Republicans to agree this package of measures had raised fears that the US government would default on its debt payments. And that absolutely would have had a a, a tsunami-like effect on other economies in the world. Jonathan Davis is an economist and wealth manager here in the UK. And we really can't overstate that. I mean, we really were at the brink. Huh. Um, You are in some ways correct. And and I know that's the the angle, if that's the right word, that the the UK media is putting out, that um, had the US not... um, gone ahead and massively increase the amount of borrowings that the government can take on, that uh, there would be an absolute ca- catastrophe. I think the phrase you used was, um, that would have been terrible for everyone. Well, I, I actually take a different view to that. Um, I, I think that uh, the amount of debt that uh, economy, the governments have right across the world, particularly in the UK and indeed in the US, um, those are the causes of the malaise in the economies, Um, never mind the bankruptcies that we've Mm -hmm. seen right across Europe. Uh, And I'll be very specific. Had there been a default at this time, um, what would have happened is that um, uh, the U.S. currency would have gone through the roof because global markets would have realized that the U.S. was finally doing something about its economy and not just taking it down the plug hole year after year. They would have bought the U.S. currency by the barrel full. That would have slashed the cost of, of uh, commodities such as oil and copper and agricultural produce. Um, thus, the man and woman in the street would have found their cost of living would have plummeted. And the same in the UK. 